two. Pop, two. She's back from races. Ready to kick it into number two? Number two. Oh. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Yes. Let me do this now. Why? Why? Because we want abs, yes? No, I said I. I thought you were saying why. why? <laughs> it did sound a little like it. <laughs> okay, ready? Um. um. something that you do all the time on a day when you just didn't get enough sleep. Just yep. <sighs> Break down the wall. <sighs> Kill it. <sighs> so tired. Uh, we both are. <laughs> no sleep with being a mother. <sighs> My grandma says, I think you have a hollow leg. And what? A what? hollow leg? Yeah, it means you can store store energy in your leg, you store food in your leg. Like if you go to a buffet and you chow down, because your stomach's only so big, right? It's like you put the extra food in your leg. <laughs> <laughs> My grandmother used to say, you on the, your legs look like milk. <laughs> because of how white my legs were. <laughs> That's a compliment. It is by a compliment. The way. It is. She was complimenting me that they looked like milk. That like, they were white as milk. <laughs> that you are a, a lovely... She goes, you're, that pale means woman. that you're a pale woman, and that's a good thing, because it means that, that uh, you're in the house. Yeah, you're not working outside, in the house. working in the garden. <laughs> this is literally all that meant. It meant that I was in the house. The Rubenesque era, you know, the, the bigger you were and the paler you were, the richer you were, because that meant you had food and people <laughs> to do the outdoor chores. Uh, like, no, nice the reason why my legs are pale is because I always wear pants. <laughs> Grandma, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> you know how bad it is? I can show on Netflix called Manic. It's yeah. limited only. It was pretty crazy. Yeah. Jonah did amazing with all his characters, I think. <sighs> Being able to switch like that. Oh. Oh, the salt. The salt. Okay. And then what's your face? Uh, who? What's his co-star's name? It's escaping me. The blonde? Yep. Can't remember her name. She was amazing in it. She was really wild. So it was a very strange show. At the same time. You know what I miss? Jim Henson's character. 
character creature workshop show. I think that they'd be working on maybe a Dark Crystal series. <gasps> yeah, the Dark Crystal series is supposed to come out next year, isn't it? I'm so excited! Ready for twist punches? Yes! Yes! Um, go! I'm also excited about the live action Little Mermaid that they're planning on filming. I'm excited too. I guess they're having a lot of complications as to which direction they want to go for Ariel. Yeah. Oh, I went to see Labyrinth on my 30th birthday on its 30 year anniversary. That's awesome. And they had a whole, oh, they had a whole like quick little documentary at the beginning about David, because he had just passed away. Oh. We miss you, Bowie. Oh, Bowie, Bowie, Bowie. We love you, Bowie. Uh. No one else will ever play Jareth ever again. Oh. At least not as well as him. Those are big shoes to fill. Uh, yeah, sparkly ones. I'm not 
are trembling. <laughs> oh, that's right. <laughs> I, let's not I would go, win this time. Let's not go across the river. That was hard. <laughs> Proud of you. You didn't stop, though. And go! <laughs> Three. 